Well, today marks the day health services on the Sunshine Coast take a step in the right direction. The first sod's been turned for the new private hospital, offering more than just extra beds for the region. The first sod turned. It's your celebration. And like that, the region's health revolution begins. Over the next couple of years, uh, up to 10,000 residents on the Sunshine Coast will be able to act, get access to first-class treatment in first-class hospitals uh, without having to travel to Brisbane. The Sunshine Coast Private Hospitals, the first element of the new Kiwana Health Precinct to get off the mark, the $150 million project set to create 250 jobs throughout construction. When our hospital opens, we employ 700 staff from day one and our philosophy is it's a local hospital serving the local community and we want it staffed by the local community as well. The facility initially housing 200 beds, six operating theatres, a day surgery, chemo unit and eight bed ICU. It's hard to imagine now, but this patch of land will one day be a thriving health precinct. Within a few months, foundation work will be completed complete and by the end of 2013 it'll be open for business. By 2016 the private hospital will be joined by the Sunshine Coast University Public Hospital. The Sunshine Coast will never forget the public hospital was promised to be delivered by 2014. Uh, I won't let the government forget that promise. Uh, they've delayed it by two years. Most of the health facilities that are gone in now should have been done at least 10 years ago. Simon Ward, Win News.